Schools all across the state are getting on board, and tonight, a more local look at one school that's taking the journey to heart. I just love the idea that it was so many hands mm -hmm. uh, coming together to, to work on it, and um, that we're all part of a little piece. You know, we all have a little piece in, in this um, deck that's a teaching tool, and then we all have a little piece on uh, the voyage. Malia Ane is the Hawaiian Studies Director for Punahou School, showing off a full scale replica of Hokulea's deck. A dream of Punahou teacher and Hokulea crew member Ty Crouch, shown on the left. It was built right at the school. It took five months of hard work by students, staff, and alumni to bring that dream to life. Kids of all ages jumped in, sanding each and every piece of wood, and then the wood lashed together. It was no easy feat. For our Hawaiian four class, we helped to build this deck. Um, it was a long process that we each took our own small part in. We helped to sand and then to lash the deck together. And so it was a way for us to see that our own small contribution could create something bigger. It was just such a small space to fit the crew and the equipment needed that it really surprised me is how small it is, but it really shows how much they have to work together to actually live on such a small area. It has a lot to offer to students of all ages. We have a steering sweep um, to help the kids understand how it, it's really um, guiding the canoe, giving it direction, and then we talk a lot about how they fish and how fish is very important in their diet on the way. And then we have some uh, paper mache animals that were brought on the first voyage and some of the plants that were brought. Yes, even Maxwell Namu Namu, the pua'a or pig, is right there in his cage. Lots of learning experiences for all ages, from cooking stations to coolers, and even packing the canoe, which will be happening soon with the real hokulea. How do you pack the canoe? Uh, when you pull things out, you, you can't pull it all from the same place because then it becomes unbalanced. So it's a great math lesson. It's a chance for Punahou students to learn firsthand what crew members face and in their own way to ride along on this historic voyage. Then they have a much deeper appreciation for really what's going to happen and how big this really is and that they're living in history. It's not like I'm reading it about it and that it already happened. I'm, I'm in the history, which makes it very exciting. Now, through technology, crews on board the canoes will be sending video and stories back about the voyage, including a look at the ports that the canoes will stop at. And utilizing Google Hangouts, crew members will be talking story live in video chats with schools all around the state. 